Welcome, Virgos. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. This is the portal reading for the month of April, May, and June. Virgos, let's see what is coming out. Please remember to go and listen to the general readings because there could be information that did not come out in this um, reading, okay? And there's always extra information. Go cross watchers. Also, check out the year reading to see what is coming up in April, May, and June. Virgos, I want to say thank you for being here. Your Earth sign. Um, we have the general energy of the, um, here, um, and then we have, uh, oh, we have here, and there's a whole lot that is going on. All right. So Gemini, let's see what's happening. Victory and success for you, Gemini's, whatever is transpiring in the month of April, victory and success is coming up. So, Gemini's, this is good. I see you're moving forward in the month of um, April, and that is absolutely fantastic. If you have a legal suit, you're going to be winning and winning big, but we have to see the other energies that is following. Again, we have a positive energy of the lovers in the month of May. Some of you could be getting married in May. Um, this is a positive energy that is coming up. Some of you are going to be moving forward with the relationship that you're in in this period. I see balance. Your own energy comes up in the month of June. This is positive because it's your own energy. Um, this is the energy of uh, um, balance is coming up to bring balance in your world. Now, Virgos, um, you guys also have a very, very positive reading, but I see you better be clear um, because you're getting out of the way of your enemies. So a lot of you Virgos had a lot of enemies. You weren't aware. You weren't even realizing that you had so much enemies. And it's as if in these three months, you are going to be finding out the truth about the lies and deceptiveness of these enemies. Okay. Whoever these enemies are, um, you are going to be walking away from them in this month of April, May, and June. So what we're looking at is that uh, movement. Um, the general energies, and go listen to the general energy. General energy is the energy of justice in the month of April, and you have victory and success. So obviously, um, whatever legal issues that some of you were dealing with, this is going to be over in the month of April. You're going to be overcoming um, these situation. Then in the month of May, I see the energy of the lovers. However, the energy of the lovers is coming up. I see that some of you weren't even aware that your partner was your biggest enemies. It can happen. Okay. Love can turn to eight, especially if you use love magic to bring someone in your world. This love can turn to eight. Then I see the energy of, uh, um, the, your own energy coming in to balance out. So you have fire, you have water, and you have hurt. This is very a balanced period for you Virgos, okay? I see you are on top of your game because your enemies are trying to reach you, but they can't reach you because it's as if they're wondering, what the hell? Really? After all we have done, yeah, after all you guys have done, the Virgos still come out. So kudos to you, Virgos. And this is my word, kudos. I'm the one who started using it, then everyone started using it. Kudos to you, Virgos. This is good. So Virgos, whatever issues and situation you are dealing with with the law or as someone who was investigation or um, this person could be um, a Gemini, Leo, or Sagittarius. This person is older than you are. You're going to be overcoming. If there was some legal issues, you're going to be overcoming the issue and the situation in the month of April, okay? Then we see you're having issues to deal with. So some of you, Virgos, this is a mother and a sister, and maybe the woman is your mother and the man is your uncle, but I see you're just going to overcome the issues that they have created for you. And 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 I see that whatever has transpired, is, 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 there is some conflicts. This is a family conflict. This is a conflict with the parents. Whether your parents is, a, is the man or uh, is your father or the mother, there is some issues that is transpiring that has to do with 
the air sign people older than you 50 years and older or older than you and this is coming up in the month of April and I see that you're going to be overcoming this situation I see that some of you you and your partner could be receiving a lot of money because of some um, lies and deceptiveness and people who have used their powers over you I see a lot of money is coming in so Virgo's money is looking good especially in the squirtle in the month of May you're going to be receiving a lot of money because of some lies and deceptiveness that an um, air sign person a man has created this could be your partner that you're um, divorcing this person or some of you could be meeting a rich um, Aquarian Gemini or Libra person now I see um, the energy because this energy comes out in the reverse so some of you younger um, uh, younger um, Gemini uh, Virgos some of you are younger Virgos your mom I see some issues with your mom that you have to help your mom financially out whatever is happening and transpiring I see um, some of you have to help your mom financially out okay um, I see that you wanted to celebrate you thought of celebrating a situation some of you are going to be celebrating a situation because I see money is coming in and it's not going out I see you're celebrating a situation it's like a legal issue is over but um, you're celebrating but it's as if Jesus why did it have to come so far okay whatever is transpiring is like you're saying Jesus why did it have to come so far then I see you're get receiving an offer I can't say it's offering you something but just as if no thank you I don't want that okay so I see um a cancer has to pay you a lot of money um, because some of your cancer has gotten you in some deceptive situation and I see this is going to be happening in the month of June where I see um, you are not happy with a situation some of you are dealing with a cancer you're not happy with a situation okay um, whatever this is I think you want to end a collaboration or end a relationship or end something with a cancer because whoever this cancer is um, um, Virgo whoever this cancer is is that no you you take some payout and that sort of a thing and you're like no I, I just don't want to do this with this person anymore because I find this person to be so deceptive okay so this cancer um, it's, it could have been that some of you really go get married to a cancer and now you're wondering was this the right thing to do some of you are in a relationship with um, with um, an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and you're not really happy so I you know this is really coming up so I see some of you are going to make a decision about a Taurus Virgo or a Taurus Virgo Taurus Virgo now um, some of you Virgos are going to be making a decision about your father or about a business partner or a family member that is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra you overcome a situation with him um, he had uh, you know cost you a lot of problems you have overcome a situation with him and I see you're gonna make a decision to travel and see someone because there is someone your soulmate or twin fleet is somewhere else and I see you're going to decide whether or not you're going to be traveling to see this person whatever is happening and transpiring I see some of you um, ladies or uh, you could have been married to an Aquarian Gemini or Libra and uh, whatever the situation is is that uh, um, these two people you know these two people these two people are like sisters and brother and um, you used to work with these two people but however it is transpiring I see the energy um, that is coming up with an Aquarian Gemini or Libra this could be a sister or someone who you have known you're wondering how this is going to go because I see that you Virgos um, ladies whatever is transpiring between your sister and brother or you and your sister-in-law or brother-in-law it's not looking that good and it's as if you want to step back so you ladies um, 
you want to step back. I see some of you who are heartbroken because of a situation what a Libran have done. Whoever this person is, you're very heartbroken. Um, it has to do with uh, um, a Capricorn. Um, it's good that um, they have done something to a Capricorn. You found out you got caught up in it. This Capricorn, you could have been in love with this Capricorn. This Capricorn was in love with you. They could have been on the, the, the internet or the computer of this Capricorn or the telephone of this Capricorn. That was how they got in touch with you. Okay. And then um, a huge deceptiveness that you got yourself in. And then the fire just hash and hash because of an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person that lies. This person is a Libra or this person is a lawyer. So whoever, a lawyer lied about a situation about a Capricorn person. There was so much lies and deceptiveness. Um, they lie about this person. And, and then now everyone is finding out that these people, it was a hate crime. Okay. And you're thinking, oh my God, I really do something like this to my own. These people are lie and deceive. And whoever this lawyer is, she's really sick. Okay. So Virgos, um, I see you're saddened. You Virgos are just saddened by a situation. I see you're having some issues with an Aquarian person. You're saddened. You're really saddened by a situation. Okay. Because you realize what um, money how uh, money i see all the lies and deceptiveness of a gemini is coming out i see um you're seeing that uh, this this that sh that either your mom or a lawyer was very deceptive did not speak the truth and you virgos are like just so pissed off you virgos are pissed off because your virgos thought oh my god um this lady um you know I'm trying to help this lady, but this, this, this lady is just not being honest. So I see that some of you are just going to be stepping back because um, you're realizing that it's as if this lady doesn't need any help. It's an Aquarian lady and it's as if she doesn't need any help. And some of you are going to be seeing that whoever the Gemini woman is, that this person is seriously sick. And I see you're going to be walking away. And ladies and gentlemen, um, collaboration. I see some of you who was heartbroken from a relationship with a Capricorn. I see you want to return to this person. I see, um, I see you realize that this person was the only normal person and, um, it's definitely a Capricorn. I see the end of May, June, you want to reconnect with this person, but you don't know how to. Okay, because you realize that uh, they have created such lies and deceptiveness. You have worked along with other people. And I see you really want to connect with this person. But it's as if you're thinking, no, I don't know. I don't want to um, deal with this situation because of the deceptiveness of what has been transpiring. And I see the energy where some of you men, 50 years and older, is going to be finding out um, your worries is going to be over about uh, um, some inner conflicts. You men 50 years and older was having some inner conflicts. I see inner conflicts about uh, um, um, a younger person. It could be a child where there could have been some legal action. So whether or not you're going to have custody of your child or not, you're like, you know, something, let me let it go. Here you go. I told you about a deceptiveness that some of you are dealing with where you found out some lies and deceptiveness from a cancer person um, that created some lies and deceptiveness over a Capricorn. But you realize now that the Capricorn, this woman don't even know what these people are going on about. And they, you realize that the cancer was lying. Okay. The cancers, the lawyer, everyone, your family member, your husband or wife was lying. Um, and you're just, you're tied up with the situation. Um, some of you are dealing with a cancer. You're tied up with the situation. You see the deceptiveness that was created. 
okay and you're tied up with this uh, situation you're seeing the truth about some deceptive move and some deceptive play I see you're seeing a situation about a Scorpio um, you men I see a, a lot of opportunities business opportunities going to be coming in for you businessmen but I see you're tied up because you're not seeing the truth about a scorpion so you men are tied up because you're not seeing the truth about a scorpion some of you men I see that some of you men are emotionally in balance because you're not understanding what is happening with a scorpion I see a cancer some of you are dealing with a cancer and there is some deceptiveness some of you men 50 years and older I see an investigation about some money and a car I see heartbreaks is coming up investigation about some money and a car heartbreaks is coming up some of you are um are like kind of tied up and not seeing a situation clear about um um, a Capricorn because there is it, it's like nobody understand what exactly is transpired um, it's gonna come out that a cancer as um, um, steal or try to get away with a, some information with a Capricorn but they were caught they were caught so a cancer tried to steal some information from a capricorn but they were caught okay so there is a lot that is going on i see some of you are trying to make a a decision um because of heartbreaks the heartbreaks is now over and it has to do with um some collaboration some contracts some deceptiveness and you're ending it because you realize the lies and deceptiveness of these people now you women um what is transpiring is that uh, you're coming out of the cold um you women had a situation with a um, um a conversation with a taurus whatever because you weren't seeing the truth of the situation um so you communicated with a taurus then I see the, the situation where some of you have inner worries. Your worries is going to be over about an Aquarian Gemini liver. This could be a mother figure because I'm seeing this as a mother figure. And I'm seeing that some of you, um, because of your mother, you choose. And it's not really that. I see that now you want to reconnect with a, a Capricorn. But the situation is that, you know, your mother likes the capricorn but there was some stuff that was done against the capricorn that you're not aware of if your mom um you know how the you know if the relationship is going to be the same so it could be a mom and a daughter-in-law is coming up where some issues but i see you're going to try to speak to a taurus to see that how it, this is going and to find out the truth about the situation because you realize that some real injustice and I see that you realize I don't want to connect with these people I want to find out from her the truth of what has been transpired and I see um, you're going to be letting go a situation because you see so much deceptiveness that has traveled some of you are going to be finding out that is an eight crime some of you are worried about your mom if your mom is an Aquarian Gemini or Libran um, I see you're worried about your mom okay some situation at transpire your mom and your haunt if your aunt is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I see you have to make a decision um, and and especially you men um, 50 years and older have to make some decision or men on a whole have to make some decision about moving forward and some hardship that you're in i see the heartbreaks is going to be over about some money i see um investigation is coming out about the lies and deceptiveness there are multiple offers that is coming up i see some of you are uh, tied up and not seeing clear about a capricorn this is someone who you're really in love with this person is like a soulmate or a twin flame this is a soulmate on a twin flame because you're not married to this person, but um, your heart, this person is always in your heart and you're trying to figure out, you know, it, is there ever going to be 
um it's as if you 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 have this person so close by you and the person has left and, and now you're realizing jesus it is my twin flame or soulmate you saw some deceptiveness that a cancer has done against uh, um um uh, uh, you know your the love of your life and you're you're really really looking at people in a different light so i see you're turning your backs on an aquarius gemini or libra person whoever this person is it could be a libra i see you're turning your back on this person it could be a father figure it could be a family figure but you're like mm, no i'm not feeling it I see some secrets about your mom. If your mom is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, I see some secrets about your mom is coming out where some of you, I think your haunt is going to be telling the secret about your mom if your mom is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran. Money, I see an offer of money is going to be coming up because some money was stolen um, from you or um, some money was stolen from you or your family or because of a legal issue. I see some money is going to be returning to you. I see an offer of collaboration is also going to be returning to you. I see the Knight of Pentacles is here. Okay. And the Knight of Pentacles, you young people, um, could be have to pay out some money. Um, you young Virgos could be also paying out some money. However, that is transpiring. And you're worried you have to pay um some money and you're worried so could be you know then um i see justice i see justice is coming down on a cancer whoever this cancer is and whatever this cancer has done i see justice the finally the truth is coming down and justice is coming down on a cancer for what they have done so there is no happy happy um thing about this cancer there is no happy thing about this cancer i see a tower moment coming down for a cancer a tower moment is coming down for a cancer whoever this cancer is this cancer created some illusion um and i see they're finding out exactly what this cancer has done and i see them 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 uh Virgas, bam, 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 Virgos, twice in a twice, and this is your overall energy. So, Virgas, what is this quarter is saying to you? And please share these videos. It is important that a lot of people receive the message for this video. Is that Virgos? I see you're getting over. And overcoming your enemies and you're going to be victoriously successfully overcoming the deceptiveness of your enemies some of you this enemy is a cancer um, for some of you and some of you um, whoever the your enemies are your victory your your overcoming your enemies the lies and deceptiveness of these people and these situation you have no regrets you're like you know the you people are seriously off the the chart so um wonderful I see um the um, offer of money is going to be coming up that is in the center so if there was a legal issue or someone has accuse you wrongfully i see um the offer of money is going to be coming up for some of you i see some of you are turning your backs on um your mom if your mom is an aquarian gemini or libra because your haunt or your um your aunt or someone is going to be telling you especially you ladies ladies 50 years and older you could be turning your back on your sister or your mother or some family member or some in-laws because they told you the truth about what has transpired some hardship that they were in i see that um some of you are really going to be getting help and people are going to be collaborating with you because uh, people have really found out uh, the deceptiveness that has happened and has transpired okay there was a lot of deceptiveness at play ladies and gentlemen it is unbelievable but you gotta know there was really a lot of deceptiveness at play and i see you're going to be coming out of this um you know whoever this cancer is you know good for what um whoever this cancer is you know good that they were picked up for the deceptiveness i see a tower moment is coming down also 
on a Cancer and a Gemini. Whoever these Cancers and Gemini is, I see that there was an investigation that was taking place against these Cancers and Geminis. And I see a tower moment because they found out, and it's a young Cancer. Um, I see a tower moment that came down because the truth, the truth came out about this Cancer. All right. So men, um, men 50 years and older, I see a lot of options is going to be coming in. I see your worries is going to be over, but men 50 years and older, I see a tower moment. A tower moment is happening for you men 50 years and older, whatever is transpiring. I see a tower moment, okay? So some of you men 50 years and older, you weren't aware, but there was some investigation um, there's definitely was some investigation that was transpiring. You men was not aware of this, but I see you were under investigation. A tower moment came down and I see what is happening and what is transpiring. Um, the opportunities that you men thought you had is not there anymore because a huge tower moment because you were under investigation. You have done some stuff. And you thought you would have gotten away with it. And that is only for the men 50 years and older. Yeah, I'm sorry that this message that is coming up. Okay. So let's move on and see what is the energy that is coming up. Okay. So we see the phoenix rise from the hashes. So Virgos, this is good. This is one of the best, best reading. The energy of the phoenix. The phoenix rise from the ashes. This is definitely and unspeakable this is one of the best best card in the deck whenever the phoenix rise from the ashes what is happening is that you need to call upon the phoenix the phoenix um this phoenix that is rising from the ashes is one of the the special okay because there there are um special energies that is used and uh, um let me tell you um where the phoenix because you have the phoenix and uh um, it is the spirit of the phoenix. Okay, so what is happening and what is transpiring? I still haven't gotten through to read this book yet. I got so much things going on. Is that the circle is like the source, the powerful source is speaking. Okay, so freedom from suffering, Virgos. Freedom from suffering. Freedom and past karma reincarnation so what you virgos are basically doing whatever is transpiring with all these people that is transpiring because you have virgo men 50 years men and women 50 years and older the energy of the phoenix represent the transformation of our past it doesn't mean running um from it and denying it or burning bridges uh, with rage the phoenix empowers an advanced technique describing in yoga as the burning of the impurities through practical and deception of tapas okay the essence of the phoenix is with us when we realize we have been suffering too long and something must change we take a stand and decide to live consciously instead of being driven by the unconscious mind and its long list of fears and adversity. At that very moment, the spark of the phoenix is lit and the great bird helps us burn through our baggages. We no longer can run from who we are, what has happened to us, or what we have done. The stuckness and the dead weight fall into the ashes and the lightness and clarity emerge. As the stagnancy continues to smuddle, the phoenix lift our spirit up, 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 and we begin to recognize ourselves. So listen to me, Virgos, you stand. And you guys are definitely going to be standing in the power of the phoenix. You also have another fire energy. And this is uh, the iron. Okay. And then you have the energy of the bat. And the bat is an air sign. Okay. 
so in the month of um, may you have a fire energy and in the month of june you have the energy of a bat where this is an hair energy so whatever is transpiring and whatever deceptiveness that was happening and transpiring um you're going to be released from these deceptiveness in the month of june and the hyena the hyena the hyena um what this energy is all about is you know and it has to do you're trying to protect someone who you love very much this is this is this is where your heart chakra you're trying to protect someone you love very much this is where your heart chakra lit and this is going to be happening in um may but in june you're letting go you're healing because uh, the phoenix came in and burn away the deceptiveness and you're really feeling this energy coming in so wonderful wonderful alignment of energies virgo um this is absolutely wonderful it's absolutely beautiful um the energies that is coming up is, is just so powerful for you guys and i want to say please share these videos whatever is transpiring share these videos if you'd want to have the um extended of this reading use the link here to connect to the um to the channel and you can use the link below um it will take you um to on demand okay i love you guys namaste until next time ladies you're going to be in the spotlight whatever is happening you ladies um you're very much going to be in the spotlight whatever is transpiring i see positive energy i see you're speaking your truth so um enjoy namaste